Next in the Den, a company from Whistler, BC, hoping to find the right dragon partner to join their family business. Hello, dragons. My name is Georgia Strim. This is my brother, Oliver, and these are my parents, Natasha and Norm. Our company is Nunapia's Balsamic Reductions. We are based out of Whistler, British Columbia, and we produce and sell a lot of infused balsamic reductions. We are here today asking for $180,000 for 18% equity in our company. Hello, dragons. I'm Chef Norm. I'm the creator of Nonapia's Balsamic Reductions. Now, our product is a true balsamic reduction. It's gluten-free, it's fat-free, sodium-free, and it has a lot of versatility. So we are a uh, family-run business. We first started producing it out of our home kitchen. Back then, for us, mass production was two pots like this simmering <laughs> on our kitchen stove. Oliver was our official taste tester. Hey, Oliver, why don't you tell the dragons what you do now? Okay, Dad, I do the credit cards and the cash at the Whistler Farmer's Market. Yes, he does. <laughs> at six years old, Georgia's first position was lead hand in the bottle sanitation division. She has since worked her way up, and now she's 10. She pretty much runs the Whistler Farmer's Market by herself. Um, Natasha, about three years ago, quit her day job, and she... <laughs> quickly got reallocated, growing sales and the distribution for Nona Pia's. But before we tell you how much we've grown, we'd love for you to try our reductions. Fantastic. Balsamic reductions for those dragons not familiar with the reduction will be thicker, more robust and sweeter than a regular balsamic vinegar. Thank you. Nona Pia's reductions are made with authentic balsamic vinegar imported from Modena, Italy. Thank you. You're welcome. Now, the competition on the store shelves for, sure. for us is balsamic creams and glazes. They are typically only a percentage of balsamic vinegar, and then they'll add a thickening gum or starch to make it thick. The family have created reductions in eight flavors, like Cabernet Merlot and Strawberry Fig. Each bottle retails for about $10. That's good. So at home, we use our reductions on salads, grilled meat, seafood, pizzas, chicken wings, and barbecued Excellent. ribs, anything. Yeah, it's very good. Well, Jeff, um, you and I have met each other before. Yes, we have. Lots of trade shows. I actually have a couple of bottles of your product uh, in my fridge there. I use it all the time. I think it's a great product. You can taste the acidity. You can taste that freshness there. Mm -hmm. My concern would be is can you produce this in mass scale and make money at it? Because this is pure passion and love in that bottle. Three years ago, we did 369000 in revenue. Last year, we did $722,000 in revenue. Our production kitchen's in Whistler, and our goal is to grow into the Eastern market. And once we get a strong foothold, we're actually going to get our product co-packed uh, in the East. Did I understand you right that that's just in the West that those sales are occurring? Yeah, 97% of our revenue is in BC and Alberta right really? now. Really? Wow. So um, we actually just got listed with uh, Costco in Western Canada, and uh, we've started doing road shows with them and Costco will put us in line as soon as our revenue reaches around 1.3 million. We're expecting that next year, and then in three years, once we've grown into the east, we're expecting that our retail will be $3 million, and that would just be retail specific. That's not considering any food service or Costco. You know, first of all, congratulations. That Thank is you. not easy to have done what you've done out of your kitchen in three years, get close to a million dollars in sales. See, I tell you what, I'll make an offer to you. I want to come up with a balsamic vinegar with my spices. So let's create an energy. I'll give you my spices. You come up with a balsamic vinegar which has an Indian twist to it. Co-packing and all that stuff, I'll help you with that. There's no problem support finding that. But you'll have to create a line which is curry-based. I've already been testing those a while oh. ago. There you go. That's my offer. Uh, I'd like to... Uh throw an offer out here. I'll give you exactly what you've asked for. Okay. 
I'd like to get involved with you because we do have a distribution company and we're building a big facility back east for our own business. Okay. I'll go next, and I'm going to say, you know what? I think you guys are great. I think you're, you, you have a great family industry here. I think the product is adopted. Everyone who has tried it obviously thinks it's great. I had it, loved it. But I think it's going to be a competitive deal that I'm going to be out on. Bon chance. I wish you guys a lot of luck, and Thanks, congratulations. Michael. Thank you. Okay. Arlene and I will offer you better than what you asked for. We will offer you 200,000 for 18% and we'll throw a lot of milk behind it. We've both been in the food business. We have a lot of contacts in the co-back end of things, marketing, et cetera, and we'd love to work with you. So what are you gonna do? I'm offering you my name on a silver platter. What more can you ask for? We really appreciate all your offers. We would like to accept Arlene and David's offer. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> I love that that came from you. You had that, you had that, you had that ready to sign it. I love that that came from you guys. Thanks yeah. so much. Looking forward to working with you. I know, I need a hug. That was awesome, you guys. You did such a good job. Thanks very Thank much, Jamie. Thank you. Bye. Good, guys. Yeah. Bye. Good, good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Okay. Bye. Okay, go straight back to work. And one of David's most successful investments is also his most recent. Earlier this season, husband and wife Natasha and Norm from Whistler, BC, pitched their gourmet line of balsamic reductions. Balsamic reductions will be thicker, more robust, and sweeter than a regular balsamic vinegar. David tasted an opportunity. It's excellent. I'll offer you better than what you asked for. Yeah. And served up a deal. Looking forward to working with nice you. Nice to meet Thanks. you. Yeah, you nice too. to meet you. Talk to you guys soon. Okay, bye. Go straight back to work. <laughs> with David leading the way, Nona Pia's sales took off. Today, Norm and Natasha are in Toronto to launch their balsamic reductions in over 250 Loblaws locations. Doing a deal with David was great. In the beginning, it was challenging. He said, never mind distributors, just go out and do it yourself. I said, no, I can't. I can't just ring someone up and ask them to list our product. He said, yes, you can, and you, and you will. Go and try it. This is our classic balsamic reductions. Actually, that's great. In the last two months, we've increased from 350 stores when we first aired, and now we're in over 1,600. Our revenue when we went on Dragon's Den was $772,000 for the year, and we're on target to get to about $3.2 million for this year. So, yeah, it's been crazy. I'll take a sample. How are you, my friend? David made a surprise visit to lend his support. How's the sampling program going? Hi, David. How are you? Good, how are good. you? And cooked up even more good news for Natasha and Norm. So I've got some big news. Uh, the meeting with Cisco that I mentioned may happen, is happening. Oh, and wow. I'm very excited. Oh, but the bad news is it's in an hour. Oh. oh, wow. So I hope you guys are more or less wrapped up here because we've got to yeah. go. Occasionally you'll have a meeting pop up that is a very, very high impact potential, but you don't have much time to prepare it. Cisco is the world's biggest food services provider. And so they not only can help us to take our product Canada-wide in restaurants, but they can also help us to make links to their U.S. partners. So, I mean, it's a big meeting, no question about it. It's in one hour. Yes, and we're, and so we're not ready. We're not ready. <laughs> we're not prepared at all. Oh, my God, well... We have to fly by the seat of our pants. Yes, like off we, we go. We have to leave right now and present. <laughs> Cisco services hotels, restaurants, and over 400,000 customers worldwide. If the Nona Pia's team can secure a deal as one of Cisco's official suppliers, it could double their revenue. I think it's this way. Meetings like this are important because you really can't break into food services on your own. You need to have a major partner. They're the best of the bunch by far, so you want to make it work. There's a lot at stake today. Hi, everyone. Hello. Hello. Dave, good to see you again. We'll just deliver a couple of samples to you. Thank you. You're welcome. We create a line of gourmet balsamic reductions. They're true balsamic reductions, and you'll see them used in restaurants, and that's why we're here today, because food service is a huge opportunity for us. So have a taste. We wanted to do one thing well rather than diversify and so we decided to go the retail route and we've done a lot of work with David and we've managed to get our product listed with all of the retail. Loblaws, Sobeys, all the big players are on board. 
It is a unique product. There's nothing like it. There's no other true reduction in the marketplace. So I, I really like it. I'm very biased, but I really do like it. <laughs> different from what's out there. You guys are very passionate about it. With that type of passion, working with our reps, that'll basically get the ball moving. Yeah, hopefully, thanks. We definitely like what we hear. Yeah. I could very well make this uh, a winner. Across Perfect. The wow, exciting. Thanks again. Well, thank you for coming. Yeah, Natasha you. and Norm, they're truly passionate about their product, and that's what we like to see. Uh, we'll go to the next step after this as far as presenting it to our teams across the country but certainly we like what we see at this point in time, so. We didn't think that was possible, but um, yeah, food service. Good little surprise from David. We'll be, yeah, yeah. We'll be We've been trying to do that for a couple of years now, so yeah, awesome so. opportunity for us. Yeah, perfect. I get asked a lot, why have you invested this much in Dragon's Den deals, time and money? Fantastic. But a lot of it is just desire to help entrepreneurs. I mean, I've been very lucky in my life and things have worked out well, so it's a good form of giving back.